Sometimes you find yourself out of the office, but wouldn't it be great to have out-of-office responses to specific emails? With Zapier and OpenAI, that's now possible. In just a few minutes, you can have emails automatically sent out, just for you. As long as you have a Gmail and Zapier account, we could dive straight in. In order to get started with this workflow, I need to create a Zap. In Zapier, a Zap is a simple way to connect different apps and make them work together automatically. I can create my Zap by clicking the plus button on the left-hand side of the screen. To start our Zap, we'll need to create a trigger, or the event that starts any Zap. Because I want Gmail to trigger an email auto-response, I need to use Gmail as my trigger. I can find the app by typing it into the search bar and clicking below. The trigger screen will then pop up. I should click New Email as my event and then click Continue. Setting this as the trigger means that anytime Gmail sees an email is sent to our inbox, it's going to run this workflow. The first time we set up Gmail, we'll need to connect it with Zapier. A link will pop up for you to log into your Google account. And don't worry, Zapier will only perform the actions you tell it to in a given Zap. We'll then need to fill out our trigger apps data. To do that, select the mailbox you'd like to use for your Zap and click Continue. Selecting the proper mailbox will tell Zapier to only auto-reply to specific emails. In order to finish setting up the trigger, we'll need to pull in some example data. To do that, click Test Trigger. Testing our steps ensures that the data we entered is working. You're all set with the first step. Click Continue and we can start creating our action. In Zapier, an action is a task that happens automatically after our trigger is set off. Type in Gmail into the search bar and select it on the drop-down menu. Next, click Send Email and click Continue. Log into your account once more and click Continue again. From there, we can start to assign our trigger apps data into the Action Apps fields. To fill this out, we can use both text as well as data from the trigger step. First, under 2, select From Email. Then, under Subject, click Subject on the drop-down menu. Next, under Body, you could type in a custom email that you would like to send out whenever your Zap is run. If you'd like to customize your Zap even more, you could fill out the other data points in this step as well. If not, you can click Continue and then we can test our action. Click Test Action and we're all set. Let's check our emails to make sure this worked. Yep, there it is. This is ready to turn on. Now, whenever we receive an email, Zapier will send out an automatic reply. I hope this was a helpful demo. And if there's other apps you need to connect, Zapier helps anyone connect apps and automate work. No coding required. You could sign up and start for free.